What's going on everybody? My name is Bob from Aesthetic Imprints and today in this video we're going to be printing full color t-shirts from home. We got about 250 t-shirts to do. Only half of them have showed up so far but I got to get this process started because I got to get this merch out to the client ASAP. Now in this video we're actually going to be screen printing and heat pressing these t-shirts. Now in other words the screen printed part of this, of this process is only going to be on the neck tag and the heat press part is actually a full color heat press print that we're going to do on the front of the shirt. So first things first, I'm going to go ahead and get the t-shirts printed with the neck tag. So let's go burn the screens and get that process started. either going to make or break your brand when it comes down to the little details neck tags is a crucial crucial part in the custom branding custom merch whether you're doing custom merch whether you're doing apparel for your business or a clothing brand especially when it comes to clothing brand if you're starting a clothing brand of course you want the t-shirts and garments to be branded by your own brand or your own merch or your own company come on all right, first of all, neck tags like this, whenever they're sewed on or just applied like this, they're the they're the worst thing in the world, honestly. When it comes down to wearing a t-shirt and it's a tag like this, it's the most uncomfortable thing ever. I know personally for me, whenever it's a tag like this and I throw it on, it's just so itchy and irritates the back of the neck that the first thing I do off the rip whenever I get a shirt or if it has a tag like this, I'm ripping it off just so my neck can be comfortable. Now, how do you fix that and not have a tag like this? Well, it's pretty simple. You do a screen printed tag or you heat press a tag on there just so it can be better. And in this case, if you're doing custom apparel t-shirts and you're getting your t-shirts for your brand, for your merch, you could go ahead and customize it and remove this factory tag and brand this entire shirt to your own brand, to your own merch, to your own company. just as simple as that we just made this shirt 10 times better by adding a printed tag so it's not irritating on the neck and it's customized to the customer's merch brand or whatever they're going after now i'm gonna go ahead and finish printing all these neck tags and i'll see you in the other end Now we're here ready here in the seat press section. I popped up a table just to make things easier because as you can see, we got a big stack of shirts to do. And what we're gonna do, look at this big old stack of super color transfers. Now we got these full color transfers that we're actually heat pressing right onto these shirts. Now you're probably wondering why are you heat pressing a mug shot? Well, this is actually some YouTuber merch. If you haven't checked, this is Canel. If you haven't checked out his channel, he makes some funny, funny videos. Check him out right here. I'll try to put his channel up right here just so you guys can check him out. But he's got some merch where he got falsely arrested and he's just making some merch for his fans and supporters to get this out there. So we're gonna be heat pressing this on here. 
And of course, we're gonna be using the Racoma 16 by 20 heat press that I got. If you're curious about this heat press, I have an unboxing video of me showing you exactly what this heat press is capable of doing. So I'm gonna be using this. Load the shirt on here. Gonna do a preheat first, just to get it warmed up. Bring it out. Add this image on here. Good old finger trick. Three fingers from there. Boom. Add our sheet on top. And heat press. Now the good thing about this heat press is it has the auto open feature, which is gonna help out a ton because it's just gonna open up on its own. It's gonna beep and let me know it's about to open. And boom. Oh, super easy. What I like to do is just give it another heat press just to make sure it's tacked on there. And it's as easy as that. everybody we got this big batch of shirts done my goal was to get this all done by the end of the day and i finished this now the other two boxes already did come in but it's the end of the day i'm pretty gassed out i'm gonna wait till tomorrow to finish those up for those we gotta print the neck tag and do the front print again but man i gotta say these super color transfers the consistency in these colors all the images are the same i'm, I'm happy with how they came out but this is yeah i'll see you in the next shot what's going on everybody it's the next day it's the next morning energy is up let's get to it we got a stack of shirts to do so we got to print those neck tags on there first and then go ahead and heat press it up so let's get to it so one of the boxes came in so we got this stack to do we're still missing about 30 shirts which is should come in today but i'm gonna go ahead and start printing the neck tags on these and getting these going Oh, there it is, everybody. We got all the shirts done, all 250 of them, and all those were done earlier this week. So it's been a hectic and busy week, but I'm grateful. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Of course, I'm going to take you all along with me in this whole process of getting these shirts made for some merchandise, some merch, and everything turned out fire with these full color transfers and screen printed neck tags. I want to go ahead and get these shirts boxed up and shipped out today. So I'm going to end this video right here for y'all. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you want to start a brand or get some shirts printed or build a brand or just whatever and you need shirts, hoodies, whatever you need printed, go ahead and follow me on Instagram at Aesthetic Imprints. If you haven't already, reach out to me there. If you do need custom apparel, I'd love to work with you. I'd love to build with you or just go ahead and give me a follow because I post a lot of content on there where it's what I'm printing on or whatever I'm working on is always posted on there daily. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe. Join the grind. Join the family. And I'll catch y'all in the next one. Always remember, no grind, no glory. Peace. Downsides of working out of a basement. Gotta carry these boxes up these stairs. Oh. Two more. It's a whole ass leg workout.